most charged space, most holy space within the church. You can imagine this sort of wonderful setup between the kind of earthly power and the celestial power. Absolutely. And it is an extraordinarily powerful image, isn't it? The, the, the sheer scale of it, of course, but the, the fact of the throne, the fact is in his coronation robes, that he's carrying these emblems of power, the orb and the scepter, and the fact he's facing directly out at us from the picture. And it's a curious thing to think about kingly power in relation to the Baptist, given that he's a victim of kingly power. Of course. But of course the power misused by Herod. And I wonder whether one of the reasons that a king like Richard might have wanted to be seen in the company of the Baptist, to have been associated in people's minds with the Baptist, is be precisely because he wanted to be not Herod, a sort of anti-Herod, mm -hmm. a king mm -hmm. properly exercising his, his power. And in other ways too, kings might have seen a relevance of the Baptist to themselves in that as he prepared the way for Christ's first coming, Emblem. Emblem. Emblem.